I'm Dr. Bobby Lazera, and this is the Medical News Minute. A population-based cohort study of over 700,000 kids published in JAMA Pediatrics with funding from the UK government has created some controversy. The study simply wanted to determine education and health outcomes of school-aged children treated for ADHD and compare those findings with their peers. Turns out, medication did not come close to helping the ADHD cohort. They fell short in all outcome measures, including academic attainment, hospitalizations, unauthorized absence, age at leaving school, and unemployment after leaving school. So, ADHD and medication, what is the answer? I'm Dr. Bobby Lazera, and this is the Medical News Minute.